Hey guys, welcome back. So it's been a hot minute since I've done any reactions to Red vs. Blue. About to check out episodes 43 through 45. And yeah, apologies that it's taken so long to get this thing up to you guys. I've been battling health issues and not been very well. And work. Work's been going pretty full on too. So I have not had a lot of time to get behind the camera and the mic here and get these reactions up to you. When I've had a day off, I've been with the wife and just time to recuperate. I'm fine. It was just... I've been working pretty hard and my body just kind of buckled a little bit and I got sick. So I'm feeling better, I'm on the mend, so I'm going to try and punch out many of these reactions as I can because I really need I really need to get back in front again. I mean, I've got you guys waiting, it's, it's not right. You don't want to be waiting for things. But in any case, we're going to continue on with Red vs. Blue Season 3, starting with episode 43. And um, yeah, like you, like I said about the reactions to this show, you know, I'm just chilling. This show is like a, it's fun, I'm just chilling like a villain watching IVB. Do people still say that? I don't think you do. Chilling like a villain. I like it though, it's catchy. Okay, are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Welcome back, boys. Good to see you too, man. Fools have fallen right into my hands. Only now do you realize the folly of your folly. Make your time. <laughs> Prepare for an oblivion. For Catch me up. There is no preparation. <laughs> I don't ever remember what we last watched. That's right. friend is the only ally I need. Lopez, activate weather control routines. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was perfect. Cool. Are those runic symbols the sign of some ancient technology? No. I used to draw them on my binder during study hall. I always huh. wanted to use them for something. Aren't they cool? Shut up. Oh, Samson's back hair. They found our secret weapon. Samson's I back hair. <laughs> one critical piece of technology to make it work. <laughs> yes, and now that I've located those B batteries, the universe will be mine. <laughs> those B batteries are important. Are you serious? You couldn't find D batteries. Only a gas station. D batteries, even. And they're just so darn expensive there. Is there a B What's battery? What's going on? You want the long is? version or the short? Basically, you've got a 50 megaton bomb in your gut. Ten, sir. And Lopez is about to kill us all. That didn't make any sense. What's the long version? That was the long <laughs> version. The short version is, we're boned. Hey, Griff, are you okay? We're boned. It's a hard time, Simmons. I'm not the man you used to know. Hard time? We were only separated for five hours. Time moves slower on the inside, Simmons. It seemed like seven or eight hours to me. <laughs> you Bullshit. fools will never defeat me. Your five minutes being foolish. Foolish fools. Ha! Ah, oblivion is at hand! Sarge, I have an idea, but I need you to distract him. <laughs> it's a remote chance, I know. But it's worth a shot. Ah, oblivion is at hand! Yeah, that might work. <laughs> Cover your ears, guys. This thing is really loud. This is it. Not so fast, O'Malley. Maybe we can't stop you, but I know who can. All right, new level, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, <laughs> the crusade has begun! Our hour of glory is now at hand! Let all who would stand against us be washed in our divine light! Yeah. Oh shit! I <laughs> <laughs> oh, miss those crazy fools! We need to disarm Church's bomb, Sarge! Right! Yeah! Woohoo! Hold still, son! This'll just take a second! Don't you ever install anything above the waist? Oh no! <laughs> Good plan. Sir, you had to get just one last ass kiss in before we died, didn't you? Hop, 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 hop. <laughs> That's disgusting. What are you doing? Let me try. Let me try. <laughs> Take that, dude. I'm being fired. Are they meant to be sitting on you? There's one thing I can do. Hey, they're what sitting the on you, right? There's only 20 seconds left. If I blow you up before the bomb goes off, there's at least a small chance the rest of us will live. But the rocket will kill me. Ten seconds. You're going to die anyway when the bomb goes off. What can I tell you, pal? Misery loves company. Five seconds. Sorry, church. Man, this blows. You guys 
duck. What the hell? Sorry, Private Tucker, but I always get my man. Say goodbye, mate. Uh, guys, I hate to interrupt, but zero seconds. Uh-oh. What? Oh, son of a... Oh, shit. This is the end of the show? Oh, where, are, where are they now? Are we dead? I don't want to be dead. I want, I don't to, want be to be dead. Or a cowboy. Ah, <laughs> yo. Oh, man, a, and a live cowboy. Throw the clock. Not dead, idiots. We're stuck in some kind of temporal. Oh no! Heads up, boys! Prepare for impact. What is happening? Mm -hmm. What happened? Uh, hey, okay. he's awake. I still want to know why I don't get a laser gun. Shut up, dumbass. Guy, you get a laser gun. Away. You get a laser huh? gun. Hey, 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 take it easy. Where are we? Been out a while. And I thought I was lazy. What's going on? Who are you people? She has amnesia. Tucker, don't worry. You are safe. For the Reds, we are your mortal enemies. Wait, that is not <laughs> Tucker. No. Tucker, I am so glad you are alive. Moose? Still so dumb, but you look so different. We're in the future. Things are very shiny here. The future? Oh, nice. I can't fucking wait to hear this one. Obviously, Lopez's weather matrix combined with the power of Bomb 21 to create an explosion so large it caused a temporal rift in time that cascaded throughout the board. Whoa, wait a second, wait a second. I don't understand. Sarge, can we do the skit now? Yeah! Yes! I don't want to do that dumb skit. Fine, but only because I want to see Griff be miserable. I miss the <laughs> old days. Great! Places, everyone! I miss the old days. The Red vs. Blue players present a Franklin Donut play. Written and directed by Franklin Donut in association with Light Red Danish Production. Can we just start? <laughs> oh, I love the curtains. Lovely. And action! Hello, weary traveler. We represent the timeline. I am the past, where things cost less and people knew the value of a hard day's work. But they yeah. only lived to be 28 years old. And I am oh. the future, where people have no morals and no emotions, but we have a bunch of kick ass gadgets. And I'm the present, which sucks. <laughs> We have nothing cool and also no morals. And I am the helpful narrator, a faceless voice used by poor writers. You have a face, I think. <laughs> Shut up, audience! You're ruining my play! Everything was fine with the timeline until one day in the present. Why does bad stuff always happen in the present? Because that's when people do stuff. Ah, uh, quit your bitching. I have atrocities and a crap load of wars that seemed very important at the time, but now seem trivial and stupid. Yeah, and I've got Apocalypse. That's way worse than anything you two dipshits have. Sorry, sir. That dipshit was in character. Oh. Well, bravo, Simmons. One day in the present, a terrible thing happened. Enter stage left. Hello, I am stupid Private Tucker. I am going to set off a big bomb now and totally mess things up for everyone. Because I am stupid. Turn because around. I'm stupid. <laughs> Hello, present. I'm going to set off a bomb in you. Don't do that, stupid Private Tucker. That might kill me. Think about this for a moment. Caboose, stop reading your stage direction. You told me I was supposed to read anything with my name in front of it. Just the lines, <laughs> not the blocking. You're ruining my big debut. I do not think we are meshing artistically. I think you should talk to my agent. This is stupid. I quit. You oh, can't no. quit. End scene. This has been a Franklin Donut choice. End scene. <laughs> Listen, son, you and your buddy Church set off a bomb, which when combined with the weather machinery in Lopez, made an explosion so large it destroyed the present. Destroyed the wow. present? Then where are we? We're in the future, numbnuts. Aren't we in the present right now? Aren't we always in the present? Unbelievable. Yes. He can't cope with the loss. He's in denial. He's right. That is so sad. Son, you're just not listening. The present has been destroyed. It no longer exists. We are in the future. Oh, that makes no sense. I'm currently working on a short film to explain it. Tom Cruise has a script, and I hear he's very interested. You're telling me a bomb sent us into the future? Yeah, you see, luckily Church was facing forward when the bomb went off, and we were standing in front of him, so that sent us forward into the future. Of course he was facing forward. 
What other way can people face? You see? That's what I meant by luckily. <laughs> what happened at church? <laughs> hmm. Never really thought about him. Yeah, weird. I, I guess he's dead. Sounds good to me. Let's go with that. <laughs> he can oh, be no. hurt and trapped in the present. That's impossible, son. The present doesn't exist anymore. What you're proposing just isn't very good science. Don't you see? If church was facing forward during the explosion, and that blew us into the future, that could mean that he was blown backward into the... Past. Oh, no. Backwards into what? The wall? A broom closet? A big rock? Another big rock. No. Oh, no. <laughs> into the past. <laughs> what the hell? Where the awesome. hell am I? <laughs> oh. oh, that was cool. Wait. Hello! Oh, now I've got to wait for the next episode. This sucks. I'm sick of waiting already. Bring on the next episode. Hurry up. Did you guys have to use, like, did you have to wait a week between installments? No, that would have taken ages. Really? Tell me, tell me how this was released back in the day. They destroyed it all, Simmons. Those damn stupid bastards. They blew it all up. Damn them! Damn them to hell! Damn them, Those damn them damn to hell! Apes. Calm down, Grim. Yeah, nice. We don't know that the whole world is like this. We yes, must rebuild. Is. They destroyed it all. I guess Those the damn dirty apes. Wasn't meant to survive. Hey, how about this? How about we explore more than two square miles before we jump to any conclusion? It was definitely nuclear weapons. That's what did it. And the explosions caused massive power outages, which caused the failsafe to fail, which released a super bacteria from a secret lab. Oh, come on. That caused a plague, and as the victims died, they rose from the dead 12 hours later to roam the earth and feast on human flesh. What? A handful of gritty survivors from all walks of life were able to keep the legions of the infected radioactive undead at bay, using only their wits and an inexplicable comprehension of agricultural science and engineering. Everything was awesome. looking good. And that's when the meteor hit. I think you just quoted every crappy Hollywood apocalypse movie ever. Nah. Yeah. Hollywood doesn't understand apocalypse. They think that just one thing from everyday life goes away and that changes everything. Like in Road Warrior it was gas and in Waterworld it was land. What went away in the Matrix? Sunlight. I thought the missing element was plot. I'm talking about Matrix <laughs> 1. Oh right. Yeah. Face it Simmons. The age of man is done. If all that happened, then where are the zombies? Why aren't they still around? The meteor killed them. And what about the super bacteria? It was infected by alien bacteria brought by the meteor and was wiped out in a massive bacteria on bacteria plague. Very well, that's convenient. Okay, then why <laughs> haven't we been infected by the new alien bacteria? It only infects other bacteria. Are you even listening to me? Do you guys ever wow. get anything done? Or do you just stand around and talk all day? We don't get paid enough to do stuff. But what about church, idiots? How are we going to get him from the past to the future? I guess he can just wait. That's how it usually works. But when he gets to the present, he'll just be destroyed like everything else. Well, he'll just have to fix it on his own then. And if he's successful, he'll get to live through the coolest apocalypse of all time. Simmons, Grip, get your keisters over here. <laughs> oh, I love this show. Look what I found. I found it. It's very Look smart in its stupidity. I, I love it. For finding. Amazing that these two actually accomplished something. It looks like some kind of an alien transport mechanism that could be used to... Or... It's a jeep. You have no imagination. <laughs> mm, let me see if I can get this thing working. How? There's no parts. Now what are you going to use for fuel? Griff is right, Simmons. You don't have any imagination. Thank you, sir. Shut up, scumbag. We're not having Shut a Shut up, moment. scumbag. Hey, we need to find church. He's dead, son. Why haven't you given up hope yet and just moved on? It's only been a couple of hours. Well, this should make you feel better. When his body blasted into smithereens, at least he took all our enemies with him. Get me though. Error, error. Get me though. Error, error. No puedo tocar mi cloud. Paul Lopez, is he out? <laughs> Don't worry, my metallic friend. You'll be up and about in no time. <laughs> <laughs> Aha. Hello, everyone. Now that we have We're this YouTube from channel, I've taken the liberty of reorganizing everything for a streamlined viewing experience. Just hit subscribe to put it to use. You're supposed to convince them to subscribe, not put them to sleep, you loser. <sighs> I hate him so much. Okay, so Church is stuck in the past. In a very, very old rendered game. What is that? 
Halo never looked like that. Where's he stuck? Hold, Hold the light right there. No, not on me, on that. Why would I need the light on my face? Hey, Sarge, what's that metal thing? It looks like a bunny. New toys. Ooh, ooh, and what's that other metal thing? It looks like a soup can. Don't touch anything, Donut. Okay, fellas, I think I've got it. Give her a crank. Guys? You give her a crank. Hey, what in tarnation are you knuckleheads doing up there? No. Are they gone? I don't think that getting new rims for the Jeep's a good idea. Oh, come on. If we all kick in, we can get some spinners, some kick-ass subs, hydraulics. I'm in. Why? Uh, for style? For chicks. What chicks? There's no one for miles. We don't even know if anyone's still alive. What, suddenly you're a pessimist? Yeah, but if we do find some women, we will literally be the last men on Earth for them. He's right. All my life, I've had girls tell me, not if you were the last man on Earth. <laughs> well, that may be true, but let's see what happens when I'm the last man on Earth with a sweet-ass, pimped-out ride, bitch. If you ladies are through gossiping, I could use some help fixing our vehicle. Oh, yeah, right. Here, let me try. Wait. Yeah, ow, ow. Donut, are you okay? Oh, I'm no. just petting the bunny, and then it went into the soup can, and part of my hand went with it. Bunny and hand soup. Like mom used to make. No, no, I told you not to touch Yummy. anything. You touched everything. That's the exact opposite of touching nothing. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? It is. What does it look like I'm doing? I'm getting in the Jeep. What are we on a date? Get the back. <laughs> We're so insecure. Well, you two shut up. We need to get this thing fixed. I feel dizzy, Sarge. Oh, that's just blood loss. You'll make new blood. You just need You'll make, <laughs> make new blood. What's the rush on getting this thing fixed anyway? Listen, dirtbag. I know I'm blue team, you like to lollygag a bit. There is no blue team. It's all a lie. Red and blue are the same. Oh, uh, don't start that crap again. You sound like a conspiracy nut when you talk about that stuff. The government put a chip in my brain. The president can hear my thoughts. We never landed on the sun. <gasps> they put fluoride in my water. Actually, that one's true. It is. <laughs> no wonder I listen to so much pop music. We're fixing the Jeep because we need to be prepared. Just as our enemies are no doubt preparing to attack us at this very moment. But you guys think I'm your enemy and I'm not preparing to do anything. Except get L-A-I-D. <laughs> Late. Yeah, we can spell. We just think that was fucking weak. L-A-I-D. <laughs> yes, this place will do nicely for an evil laugh. I was thinking of a Los, Los Angeles nice. driver's license. As a student of Feng Shui, I can tell you this house is... L-A-I-D. Shut up. Also, very breezy. I like the floor plan. Why did you fool? No mas quiero un cuarto solo para mi. That's what my own room. Hello. Is anybody here? Don't be alarmed. We're only here to kill you and take all your possessions. Excellent. No doubt our very presence has scared everyone away. <laughs> Why don't we just see if this place is listed by a licensed real estate agent? Oh, shut up! But we don't even know if it's been inspected recently. It could need foundation work. Podría tener molde. Nobody likes mold. We're moving in and that's final. It has machine gun turrets, two living quarters with ample closet space, and a short commute to my secret laboratory. It's perfect. Yeah, but what about the school district? No tenemos ningún niño. It's important to think about resale value, Lopez. Resale value? Our plan is to rule the world, not make prudent investments. Es importante tener un plan de retraso. Oh, shut up. We're moving in. That's fine. Hey, look, a computer. Now I can finally update my blog. Tenéis un web blog? Yeah, it's great. It's just like being a real journalist, but without all the hassles like liability and accuracy. No, <laughs> I need a computer for compiling evil formulas. And to rebuild the weather machine, also to download music. Can get a un postal de cuple invita. Oh, I do. Tengo cuarenta mil a dar. Es muy exclusivo. Where's the mouse on this thing? And that's one of those little red rubber dot thingies on the keyboard. That's way better than a mouse. I call it the nubbin. Who wants to touch the, my the, nubbin? The, the nubbin. No, no, no. I keep forgetting that he's talking about me then. I've actually lost weight. Guys. 
I'm on a diet. I know this isn't really red and blue related, but I am. I've been on a diet with the wife for a couple of weeks. She's got me on a healthy eating plan, and I've cut the beers out. So I just have my beers on the weekend now. So I've, I've lost like a kilo, which is good. So that's nice. Yay. But anyway, that was fun. I love my red and blue. I'm considering doing another one, but I'm going to see how, how I go with my time. I've got so many reactions to do today. So I'm looking at nearly finishing at 6 o'clock at this point. So do I just do one of each episode of a series or do we do like a couple of each i don't know it's too hard to figure out today right now it's just on what time is it it's quarter to 12 it's nearly lunchtime i'm hungry and i've got to have a healthy sandwich which is good and i'm drinking my water out of my dean my dean barry mug shameless plug but that was cool so like i said it's been a while since i've done any reactions so it took me a while to kind of remember what had happened so the evil guy what's his name again he's kind of like the the big bad Right now, he, I don't remember what his name is. And all the team have been shot into the future slash present. And the present is no longer existing. And Church has been sent back to the past. And he's looking all pixelated. So, it's fun, man. Like I said, it's just a chill sesh. I hope you're sitting there giggling along with me, having fun with these silly guys. But it's so smart, though. Like, it comes across as everyone being dumb-witted and silly. But the writing is on point. It's very clever, very quick-witted. And the voice work, man, they're having fun doing this. So I can see why this became a cult favorite. And I'm really looking forward to seeing how it moves forward. So we'll be having season three finish soon enough. And then we'll be going into season four. And then five and then six, seven and eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Well, how many seasons is there? There's a lot. There's like 16 seasons or something. That's a lot of red and blue. That's going to keep you guys entertained for a long time. And um, I'm excited. It was fun. Anyway, catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.